Hey, what's up? Jigzor here. Switching from iPhone to Android, or simply want your iCloud WhatsApp data on Google Drive? In this video, I'll show you the steps and the tool you'll need to access your chats on Google's platform. Let's go. It's important to understand that there's no direct, official way to transfer a WhatsApp backup from iCloud to Google Drive. This is mainly because of the different operating systems, iOS and Android, and the way WhatsApp handles backups on each platform. But there are workarounds that can help you move your WhatsApp data. The first workaround involves restoring your iCloud WhatsApp backup to an iPhone, then transferring those chats to an Android device which can back up to Google Drive. This often involves using third-party software. Before restoring the iCloud backup to your iPhone, you should first back up your WhatsApp data. To do this, open WhatsApp on your iPhone and navigate to Settings. From there, select Chats. Then Chat Backup. And tap Backup. This process usually only takes seconds or minutes. Next up, you will restore your WhatsApp data. Begin by uninstalling WhatsApp from your phone and then reinstall it from the App Store. Log into your WhatsApp account with the same cell number and this prompt will appear. Click on Restore and wait for the process to complete. The iCloud backup is now available on your iPhone. Now, you need to transfer WhatsApp from iPhone to Android. The fastest way to do this is with data transfer software. I suggest this tool because it's simple to transfer, backup, and restore WhatsApp between iOS and Android. The process is also quick and efficient. You can visit the link I've attached to the description below to try the software with a free trial or purchase it with unlimited use and a 30-day money-back guarantee. To use it, you need a PC to download and install the software from the official website. Make sure your mobile devices and operating systems can work together with the tool. You can look at this list of tech specifications that the tool supports. Then connect both your source and target mobile devices to your computer using USB cables. Now, open the tool application on your computer. Within the software, select WhatsApp from the choices. By default, the transfer feature is already displayed, so the next thing to do is to choose source and target. The software will typically display your connected devices. Designate which device is the source, the device with the data you want to transfer, and which is the target, the device you want to transfer the data to. You can also click the button here in the center to switch which one of the devices is the source or target. It could be Android to iPhone, vice versa, or iPhone to iPhone. Afterward, click the transfer button to begin the process. Pay close attention to any on-screen instructions that the software provides. You may need to grant permissions on your mobile devices. After setting up your devices by following the instructions shown, tap on Continue to resume the process of transferring data. The transfer process may take some time, depending on the amount of data. Allow the software to complete the process without interrupting it. Once completed, it is wise to verify that all of your data has transferred correctly. After transferring data to your Android device, you can easily back it up to Google Drive using the standard WhatsApp backup feature. Here's how to do it. Open WhatsApp on your Android device and go to the menu. Tap on the settings. Navigate to Chats and then Chat Backup. Finally, tap Backup and allow the process to complete. Your data will be stored on your Google Drive account. The second workaround is to backup WhatsApp directly to a computer and upload it to Google Drive. You can use this method to transfer your WhatsApp backups to Google Drive, especially if you don't want to use your Android phone. To do this, use your PC with your Gmail account. This process also includes three steps. 
The first step is to restore the iCloud backup to the iPhone. But before you can move your data to Google Drive, you've got to restore your iCloud backup to your iPhone. The same method we've done a while ago. Next, you'll transfer your WhatsApp data from your iPhone to your PC. We'll use again the tool from the previous method. It has a feature where you can back up your WhatsApp data from other platforms. To start, connect your device to your computer with a USB cable and then open the software. On the home page, select WhatsApp. From the choices, click Backup in the left sidebar menu. Then pick the device you want to back up WhatsApp on and the backup path. Tap Trust to trust the computer if it asks you on your phone. Now back up to get started. After that, you might need to enter the passcode to unlock the device to continue. Just wait for the process to finish and then click View to see the WhatsApp backup file on your computer. After viewing, tap on the Export to PC button to download the WhatsApp backup file and then upload it to Google Drive. If you have an active Google account, you can upload your WhatsApp backup for storage directly. To do it, open Google Drive on your system. Make sure you've logged into your account. Then drag the data from the File Explorer to Google Drive. This will upload the backup files to your drive storage. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions about the video or want me to create a tutorial about another topic, leave a comment below. See you next time. Bye.